Laura. And Prince's death is dominating social media, as you'd expect. According to Twitter, more than 6 million tweets were sent about Prince in the first seven hours of his passing. Here's what some of you have said on Facebook. We've been reading all of these. Todd told us purple rain forever. Corinne told us, I was hoping this was fake. I'm completely devastated. We heard a lot of that in the newsroom yesterday, actually. People just wondering, can this possibly even be real? And Laura wrote into us saying, Rip Prince with a sad face. We are with you on that. Tina, a musical genius, will be dearly missed. And Karen says, may he rest in peace. Too young to die, but his music will live on. I have to agree with that. It was all I heard on the radio this morning. Such a fun morning just celebrating his life, at least with the sad news. And be sure to stay with News 8 for continuing coverage of Prince's death in our next half hour. Remembering the singer, the songwriter, global superstar, and master performer that's at 6:30 right here on Good Morning Connecticut.